Phoenix is an outer space-themed, fixed-shooter video game similar to Taito's Space Invaders and released in 1980. According to Centuri's Joel Hochberg, the game was licensed from a smaller Japanese developer. Amstar Electronics, which was located in Phoenix, Arizona, licensed the game to Centuri for manufacture in the United States. Taito released the game in Japan. Atari, Inc. released a port of Phoenix for the Atari 2600 in 1982. The Phoenix Mothership is one of the first video arcade game bosses to be presented as a separate challenge. This was before the term boss was coined. Topic. Gameplay The player controls a spaceship that moves horizontally at the bottom of the screen, firing upward. Enemies, typically one of two types of birds, appear on the screen above the player's ship, shooting at it and periodically diving towards it in an attempt to crash into it. The ship is equipped with a shield that can be used to zap any of the alien creatures that attempt to crash into the spaceship. The player cannot move while the shield is active and must wait approximately 5 seconds before using it again. The player starts with 3 or 6 lives, depending on the settings. Each level has 5 separate rounds. The player must complete a round to advance to the next. Rounds 1 and 2 the player must destroy a formation of alien birds. While in formation, some of the birds fly down kamikaze style, in an attempt to destroy the player's spaceship by crashing into it. Hitting a bird flying diagonally awards a bonus score. The birds are yellow in round 1, pink in round 2. The player's spaceship is given rapid fire for round 2, where the birds fly somewhat more unpredictably. Rounds 3 and 4 flying eggs float on the screen and seconds later hatch, revealing larger alien birds, resembling phoenices, which swoop down at the player's spaceship. The only way to fully destroy one of these birds is by hitting it in its belly, shooting one of its wings merely destroys that wing, and if both wings are destroyed, they will regenerate. From time to time the birds may also revert to the egg form for a brief period. The birds are blue in round 3, pink in round 4. Round 5 the player is pitted against the mothership, which is controlled by an alien creature sitting in its center. To complete this round, the player must create a hole in the conveyor belt type shield to get a clear shot at the alien. Hitting the alien with a single shot ends the level. The mothership fires missiles at the player's ship, moves slowly down towards it, and has alien birds from rounds 1 and 2 protecting it. Defeating all of the birds will produce a new wave. The game continues with increasing speed and unpredictability of the bird and phoenix flights. Topic: <laughs> Development. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Hardware. Phoenix was available in both arcade and cocktail cabinets. A dip switch setting allows the game to be moved between formats. Most Phoenix games are in a standard Centuri woodgrain cabinet, but several other cabinets exist, due to this game being sold by multiple companies at the same time. These use sticker side art, which covers the upper half of the machine, and glass marquees. The control panel is made up entirely of buttons, no joystick is present in the Centuri version, except for the international models and some cocktail versions. The monitor in this machine is mounted vertically, and the monitor bezel is relatively unadorned. Phoenix uses a unique wiring harness, which isn't known to be compatible with any other games. Circuitry in the Centuri version CPU, 8085 at 5.5 MHz. RAM, 4 KB, 82114 1KX4 chips. ROM 16 kilobytes 82716 2K x 8 chips Audio Matsushita MN 6221AA chip along with discrete circuitry Video discrete circuitry utilizing four more 2716 2K x 8 EPROMs as well as 2256 by 4 bipolar PROMs Topic Music There are two pieces of music featured in the game. Romance de Amor also known as Spanish Romance by an unknown composer. Fur Elise by Beethoven. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Bugs. 
When the player shoots three birds in a row very quickly as they fly upwards, the total score is set to a value in the vicinity of 204,000 points. Reception Bill Kunkel and Arnie Katz of Electronic Games called Phoenix, "...perhaps the finest invasion title ever produced for the 2600", praising its "...fantastic graphics, unexcelled play action and more". The game received a Certificate of Merit in the category of "...1984 Best, Best Science Fiction, Fantasy Video Game." at the 5th Annual Archie Awards. Legacy Re-releases In 2005, Phoenix was released on the Xbox, PlayStation 2, PSP and Microsoft Windows as part of Taito Legends in the US and Europe, and Taito Memories 2 Geekin in Japan. Clones Griffin, Videotron in 1980. Falcon was released by BGV, in 1980. Votor was released by Judel in 1980 in France. Condor was released by Sidem in 1981. Phoenix was released by Megadodo for the ZX Spectrum in 1983. Eagle Empire was released by Oligata for the BBC Micro in 1983. Firebirds was released by Softech for the ZX Spectrum in 1983. The Imagic game Demon Attack for the Atari 2600 closely resembled Phoenix, which Atari owned the 2600 rights to. Atari sued Imagic, who settled out of court. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Bootlegs. Phoenix was released by TPN in 1980. Phoenix was released by IRECSA, GGI Corp. in 1980. See also Golden Age of Video Arcade Games <laughs>